artist who lives and works in Los Angeles, California. And I guess first I should say thanks to Nora and Marcella for, or Marcel, sorry, for uh, putting this on. It's really cool that we can uh, kind of come together in a space like this. And like the buying and selling is on the other side of the wall, which I think is really cool. You know, we're like closed off in here and uh, nobody's selling zines or any of that type of thing, which is cool. All right. Okay. That, that wasn't part of the poetry. This was the part of, this was the beginning here. Okay. Um, is Barack Obama's presidency imploding? Al-Qaeda is resurging, Iraq is disintegrating, and now we may look to Iran to help us stop it. Iran, a, ter a terrorist regime responsible for the deaths of thousands of Americans. What could possibly go wrong? We have drawn red lines in Syria that we refuse to enforce. We stood by as Russia seized part of Ukraine. And now we are releasing top Taliban leaders as the Afghanistan war is still going. Not to worry, they tell us. Cutter's going to watch them for a year, we hope. Domestically, we have a president who has lost the trust of the American people by repeatedly misleading them. He, by he bypasses Congress, the people's representatives, on matters ranging from Obamacare to immigration law to the point where one of the most respected liberal law professors in the country has called this president the very danger the Constitution was designed to avoid. The American public overwhelmingly regrets Obamacare. Our veterans are dying waiting to see doctors. The IRS intimidates conservative groups. The southern border is compared to a sieve. And the president assures us not to worry, smiling, golfing, and at this very moment partying with fashion queen Anna Winter because the fundraising never stops. Not when four Americans die in Benghazi and not when Baghdad is at the brink. Some people want it all, but I don't want nothing at all if it ain't you, baby. If I ain't got you, baby, some people want diamond rings, some just want everything, but everything means nothing. If I ain't got you. My tribute to the troops fighting, warm spit before vomit, fix your credit, get your money, know your rights, top floor type shit, dreams suck. Our stories disclose in a general way what we used to be like, what happened, and what we are like now. <sighs> Weird mundane trauma. We buy houses. Bad bitches, yeah. We buy drunk, junk cars. All she knows is money to the ceiling like a terrorist regime responsible for the deaths of thousands of Americans. I noticed it last night, but I don't remember doing it. <laughs> Why you want to go flex? It's a brand new day of my next hill chirping. Wow, what a fun protest. Me, me, me. <laughs> I'm in my car in the Moon Juice parking lot looking for my credit card. Just because it's indie doesn't mean it's sincere. I'm flossed out in what matters. <laughs> this is good. I know the editorial assistant I fucked at the book fair last year is thinking about me right now, which is tight. <laughs> Overall, it seems like a reflection of a generation inheriting a system that they don't want. Slime thugger with it. Lazy ass Christians. Smells like York Boulevard. <laughs> Part of me still wish we still talked that way. What could possibly go wrong? Smoking meth in your silk robe. I really love my slime and my slime love me. Significant and vulnerable. A manner of living which demands rigorous honesty. Attorneys reaching out to help you now. We insure diabetics. One of these things is not like the other. I guess I still care about you. Cunning, baffling, and powerful. How can I make this tragedy about me and my needs? Which part do you not understand? Keep in touch. We ride in Mercedes. We keep crack like the 80s. They cook it. They whip it. They slave in. We ride around the city screaming, Mama, we made it. The California Institute of the Arts. Zuccotti Park. Moon Juice. Some things make sense to me, but a lot of it just seems like the diatribe of a bunch of whiny, idealistic 20-somethings who don't really know what they want. We literally took the sickest pictures. I think I'm going to cry. See where she lives. I'll be in California. I guess I have to read it now. Megan Irwin. 
Alex Fallen, iMessage, Saturn of the Valley. I just want to be the one to do you right. I just like the way you brush your hair. I like the stylish clothes you wear. I like the, wa the way the light hit my eyes and glare. Those are Nelly lyrics. Stand outside forever like the Statue of Liberty. Who gives a fuck? We don't care about nothing, fam. I hate watching you do this to yourself. I'm 18 and I don't give a fuck about a deal. I can't pretend like I'm deriving any sort of meaning from living in Los Angeles anymore. I think I'm anorexic. All I want to do is count commas. Anyone can view this playlist. We know the price if we're going to live this life, but we like, so what? I mean, you don't have to drive all the way back to Eagle Rock. <laughs>